Prior to traveling to Hawaii, you need to register at the State of Hawaii Safe Travels website. You then need to add your travel itinerary and upload any COVID negative test results from their trusting partners or your COVID vaccination cards. Last thing to do on the Safe Travels website is to fill out the health questionnaire 24 hours prior to your departure. QR code will then be sent to your email in which you can either get a pre-cleared wristband at your departure airport and will be required when you land in Hawaii. Traveling with a child under the age of 18, you would need to add them to one of the adults traveling and add them to the other travel party members because they will need their own QR code. If you don't meet the requirements, you will have to quarantine for 10 days and check in daily. I was not able to get a pre-cleared wristband at my departure gate because Leo was not cleared and he was attached to my safe travels account. Results was late. We gotta deal with it here in Honolulu. So we landed in Honolulu without our negative COVID test results for Leo. For Leo, because we're both fully vaccinated. But lo and behold, it popped up, and we got our results. It really does. As we landed. So, hopefully, they will accept that. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, we got my here. result? We're here to see the process. Wait, mommy, we got my go result? The process. Negative. So, uh, Negative Ghost Rider. We'll go ahead and let you know once we get out of the airplane. So we've been sitting here for like 20 minutes now. <laughs> guys. Leo, where you at? Oh yeah. Let's check out this COVID-19 process. We are in Honolulu. We're going to thermal screen. Hello and welcome to Honolulu. Here we go. Passengers arriving off of Southwest Airlines flight 1460. We're just getting on. The story is we did not get our negative 
results for Leo before we took off Sacramento. Therefore, I'm the only one that got the blue bracelet. Now we gotta see how this process works. Oh yeah. Here we are. You. Have you seen you? <laughs> uh, no, but my brother and my old lady watch this together. Pretty good. Here we go. Oh. There it is. There it is. Let it begin. All arrivals got to exit this side. All right. You don't have a wristband. You got to show them a QR code for safe travel. There we go. Wait for us, Kay. So if you don't have a band like this, you gotta show a QR code. Do you see wristbands or QR codes from Safe Travel Hawaii? Wristbands stick on the great house. You mind stepping over there and pulling it out? Yep, you're good to go. All right. <laughs> so, wrist. So who do you show? Right. Okay. Just follow us. All right. That's it. Let's see. QR code. Got your QR code and wristband. Your shoes, Beth. QR code. A wristband. We're together. Yes, yeah, yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going through here. This is the infamous. Thank you. Airline crew. DOD. Central Yep. Alright. Yep, and then she's got the. Alright. There it is. Alright, so this is the line for all arrivals. I'll come back on. This process took about half an hour with the airport agent in which she checked all our documentations as well as giving us information about Leo's 10-day quarantine and daily check-ins. Day one. Day one. 10-day quarantine for Leo. All because... All because... They did not accept the optimum testing company. Don't do it. Optimum. No, if your paper says optimum, Hawaii does not play with them. It's so, not it's not a trusted company, Optimum. Be prepared, be quarantined for 10 days. If you're in a hotel, good luck. Luckily, we're staying with 
Ohana. Now we're getting our bag. Bye for now. Here we are, guys. Oh, oh, oh. Here's my kid. Oh, yeah. Right here, right here, right here. Right here, right here. Hello! Go, go, go. Yeah, there's Bubba Mike. Say hi, YouTube. What's up, YouTube? Oh, oh, oh. Jack in the box. Okay. I have a bottle. Oh, ew. <laughs> I it makes it pass. Here we are, guys. We made it. Out of the airport. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe, and hit that notification bell.